Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol DBVT. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30 minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. So if you go there, I'll explain in detail. Quite the eventful day today. A lot of volume, a lot of price action. I mean, you look down there at the volume, well above average, so in the headlines today. But let's get out, uh, map out a couple levels. And both these levels, I, I want to state up front, I'm not trying to come across like this is some sort of great discovery on my part or that I have some sort of special skill. Quite the opposite, actually. I assure you, anybody that uses charts and understands charts have taken notice of both these levels. And I bring all that up because when a lot of people are watching the same areas and wondering the same thing, call it a self-fulfilling prophecy, call it whatever you want. It can produce some very dynamic movements. And both these areas are certainly levels that a whole lot of people are going to be watching going into Friday. The first level is this area of support down here at nine dollars and eighty cents so you better believe that both longs and shorts everybody watching that level with the question you know is it ultimately going to hold i mean it's been doing a good job of holding but if it doesn't then you know that shorts would be interested in potentially playing some sort of continuation breakdown and then longs of course they need to know uh, you know whether or not that's going to hold so they can uh, you know change around their trade plans however need to be fit i mean you know there's some stop losses hidden down there from the long side where if that breaks and people are just like, well, I want to get out of here from the long side. And shorts also know that. So like I said, self-filling prophecy, whatever you want to call it, uh, that 980 mark, a whole lot of people certainly going to be watching that level. And then on the flip side, as far as areas of resistance are concerned, once again, everybody's going to be watching and wondering right around $10.10. You go through the history and you can see rejected the price cut down a couple of times there, rejected the price down. So you're gonna have both long and shorts watching that level because if the price can get a high volume break of there, uh, then you know there's definitely some potential for it to move uh, to make a nice move back to the upside direction. So $10.10 key level of resistance, $9.80 key level of support. Let's see how this one plays out on Friday. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too, good, way too good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.